Hey guys, so in today's EKG lesson, I'm going to be going over the differences between atrial fibrillation and atrial flutter. So first, atrial fibrillation. Atrial fibrillation has abnormal P waves. The P waves are fibrillatory, or looks like a little squiggle line, and your QRSs are normal, so less than 0.10 seconds. Also, your R to R intervals are going to be uneven. I apologize that this next part is slightly cut off, but basically if your rate is above 100 beats per minute, then this is an uncontrolled AFib rate. And if it is less than 100 beats per minute, then it is a controlled AFib rate. So when you have a rate above 100 beats per minute, then typically your R to R's are going to look more even because they are closer spaced together. So next is atrial flutter or a flutter and in a flutter your P waves are going to be sawtooth like. You still are going to have normal QRSs less than 0 0.10 and your R to R's may be uneven or they could be even depending on how many P waves there are per QRS. Typically, there are at least two P waves for every QRS. Sometimes there is more, like five P waves per every QRS. And if you remember, P waves equal atrial contraction. So this means that the atriums are firing at a more rapid rate, usually over 250 beats per minute, the atrium is contracting. So just a little comparison for you guys in atrial fibrillation or AFib, you have the fibrillatory P waves that look like a little squiggle line, and in A-flutter there are sawtooth P waves that look a little bit more sharp. Thank you guys so much for watching this video, and be on the lookout for my other EKG videos.